And here we go. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Oh no. I thought I was gonna see Shani. Wait, did I? I think I left a few things to loot here. Why do you pour through my ancestors' bones? <sighs> On your way, leave the dead to rest in peace. Are you a witcher or a scavenger? Hands off the family heirlooms. Shut up. I do what I want. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, Fitzky. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna loot. Like, I'm sorry about your family, but um, I'm a I'm a witcher, and um, I gotta loot, man. I just gotta do it. Witcher's life. What's it like? Don't want to know. If indeed I didn't, I'd not have asked. Go on, tell me. You wouldn't like it. Okay, so let me check on my swords. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna repair this one. Be a hundred, yeah. Okay. Those signs, I'd like to try one. What signs? Your Witcher signs. Never done it. Could be interesting. Rather not waste any time. Till the stroke of midnight, what I would rather is what matters. <sighs> Got a point, okay. Um, here we go. Okay, I guess he's not <laughs> possessing me, but po possessing me, possess? I don't know how to say that anyway. So it won't work. What's that over there? That's still the, that's the same place, right? There's another... This place looks huge. Oh yeah, it's very big. And I only went into the crypt. That must be like... Um, a mansion? The Nevrek mansion? I don't think I can force my way oh yeah I won't be able to climb that fence you meander why I was to have a good time not wander about like a knight errant you want to be a witcher so you need to survey the terrain know which way the wind's blowing just don't drag me into any brawls with beasts my jew oh with men have at it wait that should be an entrance right now maybe maybe you can't go in there right now have to wait okay it's called for roach I don't need. I don't need anything really. I don't, I'm just gonna go meet Shani. Bloody fine mount. Good stance. Powerful rub. Stable withers. Well, well. See so you know your horses. I should say so. My two greatest passions in life: mares and maidens. <laughs> Spooking my horse. Ro 
Roach doesn't like ghosts. I remember that mill. Whenever Olgird and I got up to mischief, we'd hide out in there. Once, we snuck off with some moonshine. Old cocksucker Yaramir caught us. <laughs> ah, those were the days. Yeah, it just said, um... Von Erek Estate. So I'm pretty sure the... Behind the crypt is the, like the, the mansion or something. Von Erek Mansion. Hello. What? Peasant. Oh, sorry to wake you up. I'm gonna check out that meal then. It's he was talking about it. Maybe I'm gonna find some moonshine. Come on. Pretty sure I should be able to loot that. Probably nothing here, but it's just. Oh, come on. How did I? Okay, I got it. Oh, really? That's disappointing. Okay, let's let's go see Shani. Seems like he's making on some comments when something happens. So I'm gonna try to get myself into a fight. Just see. Yeah, there we go. Oh, bear. Oh, I feel bad waking up that bear and killing him, but it's okay. It's just a game. Steel. <laughs> that sucks. I'm sorry, bear. <laughs> Sorry. Like he wasn't asking for any of this. He was just quietly sleeping. I killed you for nothing. I thought, um, uh, what is Vlodomir was gonna appear and say something? Hey, yeah. Shani. No sign of her yet. We need to wait. Oh, that's the okay. The wedding party. This is very romantic. Fuck off. Wars have started over uglier wenches. Well, 
raids have been undertaken at least. True, she looks lovely. Let's go. Whoa, whoa, hold! Need to go in wearing that. What else? Well, he's got a point. Have you seen how she's dressed? And you're going to a wedding too, so. At that jewel side in a rank tunic. You need a robe. One daren't attend a wedding in anything less. Well, let's not go overboard. A robe handy. A robe. What do you mean? What about that? No, I never steal, and I'm not about to. I'm not gonna wear that. It's uh, it's pretty bad. I, I I'd rather buy one that looks good. Oh no, we're not gonna steal. Come now, we're merely borrowing. Okay, he's gonna make me do it. But what what uh, what am I gonna wear? Wonderfully. What? Oh, okay. Perfect fit. It feels tailor made. Now for shoes. One must wear shoes to a wedding. Hmm. And we must be neat. Oh no. Are you gonna shave your beard? Fuck that. I want my beard. Oh, his face. May they draw and quarter me if I've ever seen a lovelier lass. Nothing left of you to draw and quarter, alas. Doe eyes, a swan's soft, supple neck, and a waist so slim you could grip it one handed. You're actually quite amusing this way. Oh, okay. I'm gonna play. The, I'm gonna play along. See where it leads. You see, Geralt's been a pill, a nag. That all changes today. <laughs> Dramatically, I'd say. He's never been very talkative to start with. He's been a fool, but I shall make up for that now. Will you marry me? <laughs> <laughs> a big step, but I will think about it. For now, we should simply enjoy my friend's wedding. May I please speak to Geralt for a moment? Whatever for. This evening is about my pleasure, not his. Just for a moment, then you can jump right back in. Be quick. I'll not stand here doing naught. I'm to enjoy myself. Geralt, I'm about to introduce you to the newlyweds. Please make sure your friend doesn't embarrass me. I can't make him do anything. All that nonsense is his. I feel like an ass saying it. I like some of that nonsense. Aha, uh -huh. here we go. What, for example? It would do you good to be more relaxed sometimes. Relaxed? So you think I'm uptight? What I mean is, it would be nice from time to time if you could sit back and enjoy life, instead of going around solving everyone's problems. But what does... <sighs> I don't understand. Of course you don't. You're as dense as year-old heart attack. Luckily, you've got me. We'll talk later. Let's go to this wedding. The sooner the ghost has his fun, the sooner this will be over. Finally, something that's not utter tripe. We shall dance till the break of dawn. You get till midnight and not a second longer. That's not enough. I shan't even get properly soused by midnight, let alone... Make an effort. I'm sure you'll manage. You get to frolic and carouse till midnight. That's our deal. Then there's the capping. Then you go back where you came from. So be it. Here this we way, go. my strawberry. Ah, hello world, I'm back. I'll be damned. A proper wedding. Overladen tables, plenty of worthy drinking companions, and a swarm of fair maids. But 
None compared to you, my dear Rhubarb. Rhubarb, really? Beware of the dog, Wait. Shani. Is that Judging the place? by the size of its house, the mutt must be big as a horse. Uh, thanks for your concern, but the dog house is empty. They let a man-eater like that run free? Have the wedding guests been warned? Seems we are indeed in for a cracking good time. I think I know where this is. And I, okay, now I get it. They were preparing for the wedding. What a lovely Rowan. I remember making necklaces of the fruit when I was a child. Ah, the berries make for splendid hooch. Olgerd and I brew it in our teething years. I shall introduce you to the newlyweds now. Try to behave. That should For be you, fun. my Rowan Petal, I'd do anything. It's a bit cringy to hear Come. those, Time those to words in um, Geralt's mouth. Step from your side. Well, even though it's not him, you know. I'd rather have a um, floating here voice. Voice actor do, do it because I'm, I don't know. It sounds a bit weird. Oh, I'm just. <laughs> am I gonna walk around with my hands on my hips all the time? Come on, old chap, to the newlyweds. Okay, I guess they're gonna be pushing me to go meet the newlyweds. Yes. Time to say hello. Be nice now. What? We did trick you could be. Once more, all the best in your new life. Thank you. It's us now. Dearies, blessings rain down upon you. May you live in health and happiness. Harmony and love forever last betwixt you. Thank you from the bottom of our hearts. Now go, enjoy the feast. Our turn. Oh, Quint, My Quint music. My Aldona and her chosen one, Jonas. It's an honor. The sun shine brightly on this new path in your lives. I am Vlo. Uh, this is my friend of yesteryear, Geralt of Rivia. Yes, tis I, Geralt, a witcher. Heartfelt thanks for your hospitality. I adore weddings, the brides especially. So fragrant, so tasty, I could... Righto, I'm sure we'll all have a splendid time. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk to them. I have to. Tell me, Aldona, how is it you and my dear Shani know each other? We met in Oxenfurt. Both studied medicine at the academy. Wondrous times. Over quickly in my case, alas. My family couldn't afford to keep me there. I was forced to return home after one year. It's never too late to pursue an education, my dear. Your husband is certain to help you complete your studies, provide the necessary coin. I don't know. We've not talked about it. Come, Jonas, surely you've not taken Aldona as a mere diversion for the alcove. You will help her, will you not? That is between me and her. You needn't butt in. But I'm not. I merely ask. See, I've come to love your wife like a sister. <laughs> yeah, so sure. I ask you as your brother-in-law, will you help her? I'm sure we'll discuss the matter. <laughs> That's my lad. You're a right decent chap. I knew it from the start. Okay, that was a bit awkward. Um. Aldona seems a curious choice for a bride. Did she come with a hefty dowry? I assure you, Witcher, my choice had naught to do with coin. <laughs> Jonas' family is far better off than mine. They're the textile manufacturer. It took a lot of convincing to get Mother to agree to our... As some would have it, mess alliance. Tough. You never told me. Whatever happened to fortune is of no import to me and my family. It isn't. John has told me the same. That your background doesn't bother him. Never does. Not at love's first blossoming. But give it time. Five years and you'll find few things that don't bother you. I'm beginning to find what you say bothersome. I don't know where you're from, but in these parts, it is rude to insult newlyweds at a wedding. Insult? I'm merely warning you. Know a thing or two about life, you see. <sighs> Geralt and his jests. 
He has a strange sense of humor. Very strange, I'd say. <laughs> the look on his face. Aren't you an extraordinary beauty, my dear? Why, thank you. You had your pick of gents, I'm sure. Where is this going? I'm attempting to discern why she chose you, Jonas. I mean you don't approve of my wife's choice? I have no skin in this game. I ask out of pure curiosity. Well, rein it in, or I shall have to explain my wife's choice to you, hands on. Out of pure pleasure. <laughs> Am I so testy, friend? Have I insulted you? Merely told your wife she was a beautiful woman, yet here I'm threatened instead of getting thanks. Have some manners. Geralt, that's enough. She simply fell in love, that's that. Jonas, I'm sure my friend meant no offense. <laughs> okay, this, <laughs> this is not going very well. We've chewed the fat enough. Time's a wasting. Are you uh, expected elsewhere? Me? Ha! I simply cannot wait to sample your liquors and dance with the local matrons. Jonas and I invited more than a few lovely maidens. Perhaps one of them will catch your eye. Oh, that's for damn certain. <laughs> and perhaps you will catch one of their... It'd be nice, certainly, but I shan't be terribly bothered if it's not the case. Come, let's drink. What? What happened there? <laughs> I don't get it. Take part in the wedding activities until midnight. Okay. He arrived. That's certain. I saw him myself. So if he arrived, why is he not here now? Do I have to do this one or can I do whatever I want? Okay, I get that. I can't. I can do anything. Oh. Hello, Gareth. Oh, do we know each other? It's loud in here. Oh. 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 <laughs> Don't let me stop you. Those moves. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> it's funny to see Carol do that. Okay, uh, enough. Okay. Stop singing, mate. Flowers, you, my dear, are the loveliest. <laughs> Completely young man's mistaken me for another. Not at all. I like my women as I like my peaches, fuzzy and well ripe. That's enough. Get going. <laughs> Drunken Randy. Nothing good's ever come of that mix. <laughs> One fell down and broke his head. What's next? What can I do about it? 
Okay, so what's here? here Shani. The ladder begs us to scamper to its top where we can converse. Then let us scamper. Right. How so? Just like that. Just like that. I'm all ears. What would you have us talk about? I I'm sorry, converse. Well, when it comes right down to it. Yes. You see, the thing is. I can get a good, on, a good angle because they're sitting. Yes, just as I thought. Come, it's time we return. Just as you thought. I find you intimidating. <laughs> Loudly lowing cows only ever give a little milk. I've only ever dealt with simple maids, whereas you're a surgeon. I believe I was right not to just take you and. Well, I was right to take the more romantic approach. <laughs> oh, all right. Now come. We were to enjoy ourselves. Let's do just that. Okay, more alcohol. Okay. I never say no to a lady, to your fair beauty. And what to is this kid doing? Naturally. Your elf and happiness. Fortune smile upon your white wife. Please spare me a whisper. Please spare me. Thing starts at midnight. Until then, enjoy yourself. Go wild. Oh boy, oh boy. Jesus Christ. Look, 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 look. Munchkin's playing cards. In the oh. to lighten Geralt's curse. Geralt won't mind. He's wild about cards. Gwent? Oh yeah. That's good. Perhaps you'd care to sit down to some Gwent with us. Most certainly would. You needn't ask twice, Midget. Midget no might be a bit offensive. I tell you like it. Okay, let's see where it goes with this. It's no insult. It's the truth. He's a Midget. Like I said, that's an insult. Would you call your chum a giant? Shut up. You play in or not? Let us play, gentle folk. What's your wager? Everything. The whole lot. I'm all in. <laughs> I never knew you to be such a gambler. You shall see many new sides of me this <coughs> night, my dear. Many large sides. Oh my god. <laughs> that look is what it was priceless. Normally we play that the losers got to wear the ass ears. I needn't care. I shan't lose. Oh, that look she gave him it was so good. Uh, yeah, you know what? I can't remember what I had, and uh, just gonna go with this. It's not like I'm gonna lose. Okay, I got decoy, scorch, scorch, revive, blah blah blah. Oh wow, I've got a pretty good deck. I don't need to change anything. I'm gonna try to get something better than this. Oh, <laughs> okay. Sh should I? Oh my god. It's gonna be really easy. So, what's my. Oh, okay. Here we go. It's got some spies in sales, but it's not going to be enough. OK, 
Okay, this one is mine. I'm still very confident I'm, uh, <laughs> I'm gonna outplay him fairly easily. See, now what I'm gonna do is try... Um, I'm gonna try to... to make him uh, keep on playing using his cards. And uh, I have a, a lot of revive options. One here, two, three, four, and I could use um, I could use a, a decoy to play one again, but he's probably gonna play uh, the spy he got from me earlier. And I'm gonna take it back, so I'm just gonna keep playing cards that I can revive. Just so that he. Uh, Okay, here we go. Oh, and I'm winning! <laughs> In score. Now it's a tie. Jesus Christ, how many spies <laughs> does he have? Okay, I think that's enough. Okay, I have the lead, so you know what? If you want to play like this. What's this? Okay, strongest card. I have it, okay. Okay, I think that's enough. I'm just gonna use my. Um, how do I use my ability? Yeah, I, I, I would like to use it. How? Oh, maybe I can't because it's from the discard pile. Okay, so <laughs> I need to. Okay, my bad. Oh, you know what? I'm just gonna use one. Oh, okay. That's good. I, I made him use his ability. I'm just gonna keep playing. I just feel like I have the advantage here. I don't know how many hero cards he has. Okay, <laughs> he's got a few. No, 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 I'm gonna stop there. Uh, how do I forfeit? You're definitely not winning that round, my friend. I'm sorry, but
can't remember about... Oh, I have this too. Fuck. Oh fuck, I forgot about the fog. My bad. That should be enough. Oh, maybe not. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I'm just gonna murder you because that match was a uh, kind of a pain. That's about all I can do. Your tits up, mate. Slap those asses' ears on your asses noggin. Oh, such a shame. I'd already pictured you in those ears. Quite the interesting picture, too. I know of other ways to look interesting. I could show you. <laughs> I'll think about it. Time to drink! We are at a wedding! Aye. Let's drink. My time's as short as you are, friends. To the Witcher and his betrothed. Hear that, Shani? My betrothed. Know what that means? No. What? It means we should act as befits the betrothed. And what's that mean? I woo you, you resist. But it all ends as everyone knows it must. Ah, the merriment. Good show indeed. Let's continue the ball. Lock this Gwent. Onward. Okay, so you guys. What did you want? Do you need help? Shani, darling. Oh, you shan't believe what's happened. I'm marrying off my only daughter. Wanted a proper wedding for her. Wild revelry. So I hired a, a true fire eater. You know, wool scoop, sizzle, sizzle. Ooh, I've not seen that sort of trickery. Horribly dear. Diversions of that sort. He journeyed here from Novigrad. That'll not squeeze coppers on my daughter, oh no. The groom's family have us for paupers, but we'll show them how wrong they are. Seems we won't, in fact, for our fire swallowers has gone as last Yule's bun. Groom's hound chased him off. That blasted demon. Ugh, they sure named it right. Calm yourself, Dumpling. Master Witcher's here now. Perhaps he can aid us. Before I can begin my witcherly investigation, I require guidance, clues. My witcherly investigation. Everything. Well, the fire eater arrived around noon. It is fill of food, not fire. They went for a stroll to air some gases, it said. That horrid demon saw him and started barking like a thing possessed. Why so? I haven't a clue. 
didn't like the man, sent something awry. Perhaps if the man swallowed fire, animals fear fire. If I feared, it would have fled, not given chase. Damn fool dog. How can you know? But it snapped its chain and chased the fire eater into the woods. Foolish or not, it's our son-in-law's beloved pet. There'll be hell to pay if it goes missing. You needn't worry. The Witcher, that is, I, will find this swallower of heated things. Oh, mighty generous offer, but no one knows where to look. Yeah, I'm a Witcher. Matters no not. Witchers, that is, we have our ways. The flame gopper, what did he look like? He wore a jester's cap. Typical sort. Ought to be enough to identify him. I shall find him. We thank you. And hope for the best. As do I. Let's go. Uh, awfully nice of you to offer your help, but are you sure you're up to it? You're not actually a witcher, bloody. Yeah, but. I wish to find this magician. Give it a go, alright? But you cannot help me. I must do it alone. I expect it will be great fun. Okay. You're a good spot. <sighs> Fine. Don't have to do this, but if I were you, I'd find the dog's tracks, follow its trail. Just a thought. Excellent advice. I'll take it. Shani, Vladimir and I need to find the fire eater. If we're not back by midnight, then... Relax. We'll be back in no time. I believe you. Tally-ho. Adventure awaits. I'm feeling that she... I don't know. It feels like she had a thing for girls at times. Following some dog's trail? The dog made these tracks true. Small one. How goes the search? Yeah, no discoveries of note as yet, hope, but I shan't give up. This witcher work suits me swimmingly. A broken branch. As if one too heavy sought to scamper up this tree. Seems our fire eater swallows a great deal more than fire. Or perhaps I can go to the gathering kindling. Ah, uh, there is joy in this ferreting. Fire swallows. Sparks spitter's cap, if ever I've seen one. As jesterly as they come. Cap. Chap must have lost it running from demon. Two yeah, yeah, we got then. it. Our magician is fat and a coward. Okay, I see you. And that's the dog? Missing man, missing mutt. Am I seeing this right? That gammy puss ran up a tree to escape <laughs> yeah, that puppy. Seems... I don't know how he climbed the tree though, but... And the yes, dog sir. doesn't seem... You, get down. Aggressive. Oh, no. no bloody chance. I value my life. What do we do? We chase out the... D no. Let's use Axie. Sit. Now that is power. If I'd had that, the Horsons never would have gutted me. Make it do some folly. Roll about on the ground. No. That sort of sport. <laughs> no. Oh, could you be any more of a bore? I'll do it myself. Oh shit. Roll over. Leave it alone. <laughs> Were I to command it to eat its own tail, it would do so, right? Demon, doghouse now. Now what have you done? Why ever? Ruin my fun. Have it at the wedding. Climb down. Man-eating beast's gone, as you can see. You sure it won't return? Positive. What's wrong with these Better guys? Better safe than sorry, I always say. He's gonna... Ouch. Geralt, this jester is drunk as a skunk. 
I hope he's not polished off that bottle yet. <sighs> I saved your life, man. Do you not at least owe me a sip? Of course. Bottoms up. <laughs> yeah, finish it. I say, cracking good mead. Now I understand why you wanted some private time with it. Fine mead, true. But I was fleeing a noun. And? But it, it was a monster. A, a furry, faggy devil. They chose a fitting name for it. Oh yeah, I don't want to have to talk to this guy. You're a man whose trade is literally to play with fire. How can you fear a tiny runt of a dog? Was a monster! A demon! So you yeah. said. You're a stoneless coward, sir. That's that. Oh, beg your pardon. I'm not a coward. I'm cautious. Now what have become of a fiery who paid no heed to caution? Got burned. Mm, I suppose he might singe his tongue. Guessed it. So it was that misunderstanding. Oh, yeah. Your that. cap, sir. Lost it running from that pup like a gutless coward. Oh, my dearest cap. Always brought me good luck, it has. I'll wear it for every performance. Oh, shit. I hope I didn't miss something on the road, on the road here because. You can forget about performing in your state. I just what state would that be? Look at yourself, man. You're a tramp, can barely stand, let alone perform. First off, that's bollocks. Second, I'm a fire eater, not a stilt walker. Standing straight ain't a requirement. <laughs> what the trick? Okay. Oh, you shan't pull the wool over my eyes. I know your type. Now, here's the plan. We shall head down this path till we arrive at the wedding. You'll have sobered by then. But... Silence. Do you know me, sir? When a nobleman speaks, you listen. You will stay close at my side. We will return to the wedding where you will put on a show to make our honored guests soil their breeches from joy. Got it? Y yes. Good. Then let's be off. Keep calm. Stay close. You shan't say a step. Oh, oh yeah, no. behind every step in the Nails, um, bar, so I'm gonna have to fight. Monsters? Probably not. I'm guessing beasts. Yes! Bear! Bear? That <laughs> as much as your cock's a tent pole. Hide, you blind fool. <laughs> Often bore shaped in your experience. Got weak eyes, see. Besides, I'm a fire eater, not some damn naturalist. Indeed, you are not, Master. Uh, I believe I failed to ask. What do they call you? David Altersborough. Listen Altersborough. here, Master Hattonsborough. Stay close, and no harm will come to you. I'll see to it your drunken, fire spitting gob gets to the wedding safe and sound. <coughs> The missing fire blower is missing no more. It was my doing, if I may say so myself. And Demon? What's with him? He failed to return. No, he did. He's just acting mighty strange. <laughs> Seems to be in a muddle of sorts. Got as much life in him as a carrot. Might have eaten some. Nightshade or whatnot. Your attention, please. I invite all to witness the spectacle unrivaled. A man so bold as to eat fire. We must watch the trickery. Never saw anything like it while alive. <laughs> I 
the hell is that doing <laughs> Oh, okay. Are you having fun? Let's do some dancing. <laughs> In my experience, witches and dancing don't exactly mix. Today they mix like fire and oil, my love. We'll dance the barn down. Oh, okay. <laughs> I gotta say, he has some moves. <laughs> faster, faster <laughs> until we expire. <laughs> <laughs> It's really funny to see your health like this. I have to say, I have to admit. Shani discovered my Shani doesn't side. know him either either. They don't they don't even know what he looks like. Like even if Geralt told Shani about it. Which he didn't, I don't think so. Oh, you're rather good at this. Okay, Shani. Yeah, tell me, are you flirting with Vladimir or are you flirting with Geralt or maybe uh, I am the lord of the dance. You're quite skilled at self identity skills are mere fault taste, okay. Um Yeah, I think Okay, I'm just gonna guess what's going on here is um Sh Shani actually had a thing for Geralt, but but at the same time, I think she loves. Uh, I mean, she needed this just to have fun, and I think she 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 wishes uh, Geralt would be a bit more well like this, laid back and have fun. So she must be a bit com conflicted here. Yeah, I am the fucking lord of dance. Not a man here who could outdance me. It's a gift. My legs are preternaturally skilled. <laughs> <laughs> I never expected the members of Algeard's band to have a taste for dancing. Yet it's so. We dance and dance at every opportunity. As fond of fun as fighting, our motto. Seems the music in the evening draw to a close. Know how a true dancer thanks his lovely partner? Um, not sure I do. Oh, he's gonna he's gonna go for it. Oh. Okay. Uh, what are you doing? Have you lost your mind? I have my mind, my heart, for you. <laughs> We must agree. You can say whatever you please, but you shall keep your hands to yourself. Understood? Don't be upset, my peach. I couldn't resist. I'm not upset. Just next time, don't lunge at me like that. I'd had a long fast, so to speak. Hunger overwhelmed me. But yes, next time, I shall ask. Shani. <laughs> <laughs> you are incorrigible. 
Could I talk to Geralt for a moment? What for? He'll have nothing of interest to say. The man's adrift. Please. <sighs> Very well. See how I've reeled her in? Now don't fuck this up. Geralt, I'm curious. Okay. Like Are you my wingman? You. Do you feel anything? Have any control? I feel everything. Don't have any control over what I do or say, though. Why do you ask? Because I wonder what it would have been like to dance with you. Just you. <laughs> um, I'm gonna force myself on you. I think I'm gonna be a bit bold here. done what he did still like to then why don't you well answer me thing is normal folk don't act like vladimir von everick because they are chills chills don't be too hard on him all in all he's actually rather fun i agree ha! see that i'm fun and you've got a pike so far up your ass you can't wear hats happen to see the man who announced our your song Oh, yeah. Yes, he acted as though he knew me, but we've never met. I was surprised. Who is he? Gontor Odin, Master Mirror. Wonder what he's doing here. Then perhaps you should just ask him. Yeah, he didn't show up without a reason. Need to talk to him. Consider that he might have simply been nearby and dropped in on a whim. Promise you this much. He never does anything simply. Certainly not on a whim. Bah, I was to make merry, carouse. Yet here I've stood the last five minutes listening to you talk. I'm going back in. Ah, better. Come, Shani. The night beckons us not to jabber it away. The night is young. Talk to Master Come, Mirror. Let's do something. Okay, I'm gonna um, take a break here, and uh, yeah, next time we we'll go. I think we're gonna start with uh, talking with um, Gonto G, and then uh, we'll just carry on. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next one. Bye.